Hello people, this is Kera from Raspberry Shake team and I'm here to show you how you can assemble your Raspberry Shake. So let's get started. This is a list of the components that you will have so once your magnitude 8 or 9 arrives at your place. If you don't have a magnitude 9, which is a turnkey package, you will have to connect manually your Shake to the Geophone. Here is how you're going to do it. The Geophone has a twist pair. Make sure that they are twisted except at the end because this is where the geophone is going to be connected to the shake. You will see that in your shake it is a plus sign. Connect the gray geophone wire to this terminal and then connect the blue one to the other one. Please do not pigeon and do not over tighten. Make sure that the wires are well connected by pulling them slightly outwards. Now what you're going to do is to take the bottom face of your enclosure as well as one of the four short standoff and with only your hands and not with the Allen male driver, tighten only or wheel strip. You will do this three times more. Take the Raspberry Pi and place it in the positions as you are seeing in this video. The pie header side should be just below the bubble. Now, take one of the short standoff as well as with one washer type 2. Tighten the washer type 2 into the short standoff and screw in into one of the circle holes of, on the pie. Do this two times more. There is one special hole that instead of using a long standoff, you will use the screw type 2. With a filler driver, screw it in the screw tie too. Press a little down. On the other hand, take your mini SD card and insert it in with a metal slot face looking up into the mini SD card slot of the Pi. Take now your geophone with the shade that you already connected both at the first step of this video and place the geophone in the middle of the two holes that are on the left side of the bubble. Make sure that the connectors are well separated. See that the wires look at the left side of the bubble. Now, take the clear plastic strap and place it over the geophone head. Use one screw tie to and one washer tie to and screw it in with a fillet driver in one of the two holes of the clear plastic strap. Repeat this step one more time. Hold carefully your raspberry shake and plug it into the pie header as you've seen in this video. Notice that the cut side of the shade is aside the USB port of the Pi. What you are going to do now is place the rest of the enclosure faces in their place. Take the face that has three cup shades and place it as you see. Take the shirt sure face enclosure and repeat this step. The steps are familiar for the rest of the two faces. Now, take the top face of the enclosure and put it over machine with the position of the long standoff. Now, take one screw tie one and with a filling driver, screw it into the one of the hole of the top enclosure face. Repeat this step two times more. We recommend to cover entirely your raspberry shake because otherwise you will get unwanted long period noise. We're almost finishing, guys. The last step is place the cones for leveling feet. Take one of them with your hand, screw it into one of the cone holes. After this, take one nude and screw it in over the cone. Repeat this step two times more. Use the Allen key to adjust the cone as your preference. There are four extra components, one screw and washer time, one and two, in case of lost. Put them in a place that you can remember. Well guys, this is all for now. I hope that this video be useful for you. Till the next time.